Oh, ready man, what is going on, better Welcome back to another episode of the Broke to Billionaire series. And as you guys can see, man, we are your boy Franklin. Here today, we at the crib, man. We at the crib. I got the I got the screenshot mod going on, man. That's why we was just looking at my boy like that. But let's go ahead, let's hop on in, man. Today, today's episode, bruh. As y'all can tell from the title, we finna go ahead and we finna pick up the 2021 Ram TRX finally. You know what I'm saying? It's been a little minute, man been a little minute y'all been waiting on this joint for a long time i've been waiting on it for a long time and we got yet another srt whip that's about to be added to the collection man you know what i'm saying man we just stacking them up bro. we just stacking them up we're probably going to be selling this guy right here so we can make some room for a new one but you know what i'm saying then we got the old schools going on too definitely let me know what you guys think about these guys we got the g-wagon right here we gotta take the g-wagon out but I do want to go ahead and drive the track up today, man. We got a little small job that we need to do for Larry before we pick up the Ram. We actually got to go ahead and we got to pick up a uh, another Ram. It's like, it's like a 20, I think it's like a 2014, 2015. Yes, yeah, sir. But it's like a 2015 uh, stylish Ram that we got to go ahead and pick up. We got to take that out there to uh, Larry's customer. You know what I'm saying? He had it sent down here to uh, get a little bit of a little bit of TLC done over at the shop, man. So you know what I'm saying? We gotta pick that guy up. We gotta drop that off over uh, back out to the country. And we're gonna be checking out this house, man, because uh, if you guys remember, this house was used before. The only difference is it was changed a little bit, man. You know what I'm saying? The new owners and did a little something, something to it. And uh, I think they're thinking about selling the house too, man. So if you guys want to go ahead and possibly pick it up, man, you know what I'm saying? I'll be forgetting about the driving on this one. But if you guys want to go ahead and pick up a little Sandy Shores crib, y'all let me know, man. You know what I'm saying? Because he's he do plan on selling this joint. The real first person action man. My hands ain't even on the steering wheel. It's alright, man. It's alright. Uh let me know if y'all think we should put some rims on this guy too, man. Y'all know. Well actually I want to put a little more power in it and then go racing first. So we might drop this off. Get it to like a thousand horsepower or something like that. And then we'll go ahead and have some fun with it, man. You know what I'm saying? Before we put some rims on it. Because I do want this guy looking good. I do want this guy looking good. So let's go ahead and make our way, man. Hopefully you guys do enjoy the episode, though. But we finally finna pick up the 2021 Ram TRX. Around you folks. Yes, sir. Hold on, what time is it? Four o'clock. All right, you know what? Since, uh... Since I really don't want to change my weather like that, I'm going to actually make it the real time duration. So we ain't going to worry about time going dark too fast while we're in the middle of this little job right here, man. By the time we get to the ram, we ain't even going to be able to see nothing. It's going to be dark. So we go ahead and make that a little simpler there. Yes, sir. Oh, but it's a lot of people out today, bro. Folks going slow as hell. Whoa! He kept straight? What the hell? I don't even know if we had the red or not, but I definitely got a little damage, I think. Hey, sir, man. Y'all see what's going on with the track hog, though, man. If you guys do want to be able to grab this guy, man, join the Discord. Link is in the description, man. Cause it, I had his track hog clean as hell, man. He ain't gonna lie, man. Y'all see, man. I just need to do a little editing with the uh, the seating positioning. I can actually get my boy hands on the screen, bro. Hands down, I'm trying to understand that. All right, so we done made it down here to the shop. We're going to show you guys the Ram that we're picking up. Because it's like a SEMA style Ram. And we're going to drop this all back to the customer. There you go, y'all can see it right there. I'm going to go ahead and drop the track off to the front. But we're, uh, we're going to go ahead and drop off this SEMA style Ram back to its customer. You know what I'm saying? They got his little, his little work done. And then we got to take Larry his rental that he actually gave to do. So you know what I'm saying? We got a little, a little bit of work to do, man. And I, I do want to take the TRX off roading a little bit too. So we are gonna see how that's gonna go, man. We are gonna see how that's gonna go. Just see, this the Ram right here, man. Let me know what y'all think about this, man. Yeah, sir, this one look good. I ain't gonna lie, this one look good. Yeah, man, got a North Carolina plate on there. Let me know what y'all think. Let me know what y'all think, man. Yes, yeah, sir. This one looking good, man. It's actually a Ram 2500, too. I don't think I said that. 
but I just said it now, man. I, I kind of like that toe hitch, too, bro. It's a crazy looking ram, though. I ain't even gonna lie, man. It's a crazy looking ram. We could take this off road in a little bit, too, if we wanted to. We'll go to pop a quick save real quick. And we're gonna go ahead and make our way on all the way up here to the customer crib. I actually don't even know what car he rented out from Larry, but we're about to find out once we get there, bro. We're gonna see how that's gonna go. I kind of want to take this off roading, bro. Let me know what y'all think. What y'all think about this truck right here, man? Joints pretty damn clean, bro. Going through another battle of texture zone. I ain't worried about it. I, man, I wish I could figure out a fix for the LA Rose for that, man. Because that, that has always been a problem with me, man. It, it seemed like it got worse, though. I ain't gonna lie. I feel like it done got a little bit worse. But that could just be me tripping, man. I don't know. So, hopefully, you guys did enjoy the last episode. We did some trapping. We picked up the Bel Air, bro. That Bel Air looking clean. Man, y'all seen it at the beginning of this episode, man. Better looking clean, bro. You might want to check out the last episode if you missed it. Hold on, why I got us going straight? Oh, oh, okay, okay. I forgot. I forgot. We're going to a customer crib. We ain't even. Alrighty, guys, man. We had to make a quick little stop, get some gas real quick. But we're back on the way, man. We're back on the way, man. 2.4 miles remaining until we make it to our destination, bro. Hey, I ain't even gonna lie. I don't even remember what I was saying, bro. <laughs> I don't even remember what I was saying. But. It don't even really matter, man. We finna go ahead and we finna drop this off. Cause I really wanna get to this Ram TRX, bro. Y'all let me know if y'all think we should put rims on this joint. If we should put some off-road rims or something like that on there, man. You know what I'm saying? Y'all let me know. Y'all let me know what y'all think we should do with the TRX. Yeah, I just cut them folks off, bro. Oh, yeah, bro, hold up, bro. Hey, this truck had a little speed on some, on, you know what I'm saying? On the off-road terrain. Man, he missed, he, he missed the tail light. Going on with that, but let's go ahead and make our way down here, man. Hope you guys do enjoy it, like I said, man. But uh, oh, I was talking about the previous episodes, man. Hopefully, y'all have been enjoying them joints. Like, it's a, uh, it's a few things, it's a few things that I've actually, uh, like started to pay attention to my videos, like that I wasn't really doing before. It's just like small things, but small things that you wouldn't really realize until you know what I'm saying, you actually start going back and watching videos again and stuff like that man like bro the videos have been a lot different lately bro you know what i'm saying and this cow was trying to die baby like i wasn't trying to hit him bro i was gonna splat him let's go ahead and make a oh we can pull it over okay y'all know i can't stop bro we got that warrant so that shit over with we're doing a dash that shit over with see how old the toy right here toy right here i'm going off road with it we're going off road with it. He ain't gonna catch me. Y'all. Oh shit. Whoa. Alright, uh, we got it, we got it. We're gonna lose him like this too. Yeah, sir, take that off-road path, man. He ain't gonna be able to keep up. Alright, man. We're gonna to take a little detour, right? <laughs> we're gonna take a little detour because he, he started to catch up a little bit. Oh, another one right there. Bro, I gotta get off the main roads, bro. I gotta get off the main roads. Ooh, wait. There go detour right there. That ain't no real detour, but we're gonna make it one. Yeah, sir, as long as we don't get no damage, bro, we good. I drop it off with a little, a little dirt on you know what I'm saying? As long as we don't wreck it, get no damage, we good to go, bro, we good to go. Y'all let me know what y'all think about the suspension, too. I'm trying to do what it need to do. They seem kind of bright out here, too. I ain't gonna lie, man. It might be just for me though, I ain't gonna lie, that might just be for me. But we're gonna see man, we're gonna see. Alright man, here we go bruh, we done lost 12 and everything bruh, you see that's all we had to do bruh. But let me know man, do you guys remember this house right here bruh? Y'all see it's been a few changes. Been a few changes man, they got a whole little barrier gate now going around. Now this, this, this gate is supposed to open and close. I'm, I'm assuming they got it just planted open. And there go the other car right there that Larry lent him. I'm guessing he's just lending out that damn, <laughs> that damn hurricane, that off-road hurricane. I don't know if you guys remember, man. We actually did a video with that uh, in the real hood life season. That was a while ago, man. I ain't gonna lie. That was a while ago. But we actually did a video like that, man. Yeah, hey, sir. Yes, what's going on? So y'all let me know what y'all think, man, about the truck. This was actually a pretty fun car to drive, bro. Lift it up high as hell. You got a G-Wagon in here. 
You know what kind of G-Wagon this is, bro. I ain't never seen no riding kit like that before. They're like, nah, it's just a stock G-Wagon. Then he got an LFA over here, so buddy, buddy boy got a little money on him, you know what I'm saying? He got an LFA with a G-Wagon. And now he got the ram lifted up. So he was just linked up, he was just linked out this hurricane right here. Now let me know what y'all think about this, man. I actually like this. I wouldn't mind adding this to the collection, you know what I'm saying? But let's go ahead, let's check out the crib real quick. Oh, they added a helicopter pad back here. Y'all know we ain't never had no helicopter pad. When we sat at this house, bro, we ain't had no helicopter pad. And what? Hold up, bro, they got an added extra path to go down. Bro. Oh, yeah, I like this crib now, bro. They done changed this up. We seen a little bit of the additions. Y'all let me know what y'all think, man. Y'all let me know what y'all think. Might have to go ahead and Airbnb out with my boy Crib one day, man. You know what I'm saying? Stay in the guest room or something like that. Y'all already know the interiors. I think it's still the same, though. I don't think they changed it. Don't look any different. They definitely added some changes to the outside, though. Like, I don't think this was this good looking like this. But let's see, man. Go ahead, let's walk around in it. Oh, wait. I just went into the, I just went into the glass part. Right, so let me see, man. Yeah, everything still look the same, bro. I don't think it changed nothing. Let's get to the back. I'm not going to the back. So we ain't got to worry about that. We can go ahead and go upstairs real quick. Oh, see, we can go up the steps a lot easier now. Man, I remember before, we used to struggle to go up the steps. So, yeah, man, everything kind of the same, bro, on the interior, man. I don't know if y'all remember this house or not, but I remember just about all of this. But that exterior, they definitely changed the exterior a little bit, bro. They added around that little fence area. Got a helicopter pad back here and a little area to get down there to the, uh, to the little creek. It's kind, of, it's kind of clean. I ain't even gonna lie. It's kind of clean. All right, bro. Let's go pick up the Ram TRX, man. The main thing that y'all was looking forward to in this whole episode, man. Y'all can let me know what y'all think about the off-road Lambo as well. Yes, sir. We turn them lights on, but we get full brightness. Now, let me know what y'all think about this right here. In the interior. Got the green seats to match. The dash do work. Yeah, it's new work. I like that. We're just deep as hell in this damn seat. I wonder if Lambos are like this for real in real life, man. Like, are you really this deep in, into a seat? It'd be kind of crazy. I ain't even lying. Like, you just this deep. You can barely see over the edge, man. I don't know, man. I don't know. But let's go. Let's make a way to Larry's shot. I know if I'm hitting you. Don't you do it? Woo, he was trying to die. Yes, yeah, sir. You got a little speed on it, but I like it. We might need to get us a, uh, a newer Huracan, man. We drove that Gallardo a little bit, man. I don't know if I want that Gallardo, though. But this newer Huracan, it might be a little something. We might need to go on the Evo 2. It's like $300,000, bro. And I don't know if I want to go with the off-road kit on that guy or not either. Hold on, I'm gonna keep straight, bro. We're gonna have a little bit of pump here real quick. Wait, wait, is that? Never mind, I just realized 12 be riding up and down this road right here. We can't even go that fast. I'm gonna turn around, bro. I'm gonna turn around. Let's go get the, let's go get the TRX. Whoa! How the hell you come up? Come up? He came quick. How the hell you came down the road that damn fast? Get to it right there. Boy, we almost got into an accident with 12, bro. What the fuck? But there we go, man. Y'all see it. 2021 Ram TRX. Let me go ahead and pick this guy up, man. Boy, Larry got an empty lot today. Y'all see it right there, man. Y'all see it right there, bro. We finally finna go ahead and add this joint to the collector. Let me, let me, let me put the gun up. Yeah, so y'all see it? It looks pretty damn good, too, man. With the trunk. I can't even see back up in there. A little too small, too short. We try to see what we working with, man. Yes, yeah, sir, with that newer front end and everything on that guy, bruh. We might have to get the 2017 TRX and put it next to this one so we can really see. The interior. Let 
interior. So let's go ahead and hop on in. I ain't gonna lie, it do need a little work though. But shoot, it ain't bad, man. It ain't bad. Yes, sir. Shoot, at least the gauges work. I got turn signals and everything. We're just missing missing some textures and stuff. Really, that's what it look like. All right, other than that, man, y'all let me know what y'all think about this right here, man. Y'all think we should add this to the collection, bro? What y'all think we should do, man? I definitely want to do a little off-roading with it, bro. So we're going to take it on a nice little trail. Not take the sign out. I almost smashed the Subaru. Another one right there. Why them folks love these Subarus out here? Might have to throw this on some off-road rims and everything. Let me go ahead and pop a save real quick. Let me see. Let me get a little off-road in action there with these guys. Y'all let me know what y'all think about it. Oh, shit. Taking our signs. Already. We ain't even been out here that long. Already taking our signs. Y'all let me know what y'all think about this joint. They do got this speed on them. Doing 110 miles an hour off the road. That's crazy. You ain't gonna lie, that's crazy. Alright, let's go ahead. I kinda wanna climb the mountain, but then again, this ain't really no mountain climb a truck. Yes, sir. Alrighty guys, man. Y'all already know, man. <laughs> we just gonna finna we finna fill the tank up real quick and then we finna start it up again. But we, we I I think I found a route for us to take that though, so we're gonna go ahead, we're gonna do that instead, man. Let me go ahead and make our way down, bro. And I think I figured out why my game was just crashing. So we should be good to go for the rest of the episode. We'll go ahead and take the off-road trail right here, man. Let me see. All right, so we done got the truck extra dirty already, too, man. Yo, this train ain't that bad. Oh, damn. I ain't even know it looked like that from the front. Oh, dirty, dog. This trying to look good. Oh, whoa! Let's do it! They trying to look good. I can only go 110 miles an hour off road, though. That's, that's my top speed off road. That's crazy. Let's keep on going, man. We're going to go across here, and I'm going to make the next left on the next little off road trail right there. I don't think we've ever drove down this path. Like, we've been down the path, but not at the start from right here. So, uh, let's we'll, we'll see what we do, man. Let's we'll see what we do. Hey, sir. Oh, oh. Hey, the joint nice. 110 miles. In. I wish I could go a little bit faster than that, but we might need to throw some upgrades on this. If y'all do decide that y'all want, want me to go ahead and keep this guy, man. We definitely gonna have to throw some upgrades onto this guy, man. Whoa, shit! Okay, so we spin a little bit. All right, it's all good. It's all good. Y'all yeah, see how this joint look, though? This joint look good. It might just be my graphics, though. I ain't gonna lie. It might be my graphics. But this joint look good. Yeah, so with a little backfire action, too. But, like I was saying, I think I do remember one part that I kind of cliffhangered off because my game had crashed, man. But, uh, I forgot how much horsepower this thing has. I know it got like 700 and, I think it's 700, either 703 or 717 or something like that. I don't even remember. But I know it got 700. It got 700. This is a Hellcat. This is a Hellcat. Oh. I ain't even gonna lie, Dodge is going sicko with the Hellcat engine though, bro. I ain't even gonna lie, but it's like they mastered, they mastered a, a high performance engine and they just throwing it in all of their models, man. Wouldn't be surprised if we seen a Hellcat Journey or a Hellcat, a Hellcat Caravan or something like that. Wouldn't even be surprised, man. We already got the Durango, the Challenger, the Charger, the Ram. Shoot, we, we, all we missing is the Viper. The Viper don't even need a Hellcat engine though. At that 640 horsepower uh, V10, we don't even need no Hellcat engine, but still, basically almost every model or every vehicle that Dodge produces, you know what I'm saying, they, they got a Hellcat engine. If it's not, if it's not a family mobile like the Caravan or the, the Journey, 
Or even the Avenger. That'd be kind of crazy. They throw a Hellcat in an Avenger? Or even a Caliber? What kind of... That'd be kind of crazy. I ain't even gonna lie. That's crazy. But, uh, you know what I'm saying? They done put, they done put the Hellcat engine in just about everything that, that he's selling. You know what I'm saying? If it's selling a lot of money, but they done threw a Hellcat engine in it. If it I said, if it's selling a lot of money. If it's selling and making a lot of money. But we done did some good little off-roading right here, man. Then I didn't want to take it into the water. I ain't even gonna lie. That muddy water might not be a good idea for the man right now. We ain't got no lip kit or nothing thrown on here. This one ain't that bad though, man. Y'all let me know what y'all think. Oh, let's do it. Straight across. Oh, this the uh oh nah, this the military base. We can't even go over here. But man, this ram right here, this ram is clean, bro. We're gonna need to go to a car wash. ASAP. I know I ain't leaving it like that. Yeah, we might need to throw some off-road forages or something like that on here, but you know what I'm saying? Might need to spice shit up a little bit. I think if I keep going up here, this is where I can get the other side of the trail. Yeah, 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 that's what we about to do. So I probably need to go back. We go back across. And we just gonna ride down here. Hey, sir. Oh, get a little jump. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Wait, this train is pretty damn funny drive. Oh shit! All right, all right, all right, y'all. Damn! I lost two of my doors, bro. I lost two of my doors, bro. Now y'all know we're gonna get a free fix just cause we're a little too far. We're a little too far away from civilization right now, man. You know what I'm saying? I just realized they put a trunk cover on there now. I ain't had a trunk cover on there at first. I wasn't even supposed to go up this way. Where the hell is my route, man? See, sometimes this map is a little hard to read a little bit, man. Just a little bit, just a little bit. Let me see, man. Here we go. All right, we're gonna do a little bit of off-road and back down the other way. We're gonna see how it go, man. We're gonna see how it go. Do a little interior, but we can't see nothing. But y'all see the dash and everything, man. Y'all see all that working? I got a dash and stuff, dude, but we got the double sun roof. Let me see, man. Go back in the interior. Yes, yeah, sir. Ain't got no dirt up there, though. Need some dirt up there. I just realized the top of the car isn't dirty. Man, we in tree heaven right now. Sheesh. All right, man. Let's keep on moving, man. Let's keep on moving. We're doing pretty good because I'm rolling right here. Yes, yeah, sir. Y'all already know what's going down, man. Y'all already know what's going down. Yeah, sir. Are we gonna do some off roading, some boating, some skiing? Your boy Franklin finna start living the life, man. You know what I'm saying? Your boy Franklin finna start living the life. I hope you guys do enjoy the episode, though, man. You know what I'm saying? We have some pretty good, pretty good little off roading fun right here, man. I hope that we even took the 2017 TRX off roading, the little concept round. I mean, concept headcap uh, round. I don't need that we took that guy, uh, that, that guy off-roading here. We might need to though, I ain't gonna lie, we might need to. This one is actually pretty damn fun, but that, that might be a little bit more fun too, or it might be just as fun. You never know, man. We did some good off-roading. Yes, yeah, sir. Oh, shit. Oh! Almost went clean over the edge. A little damage, a little damage, it ain't, it ain't too much. A little damage. Yes, sir. Yeah, we can't even go a hundred. Oh, shit. All right. We're good, we're good. We can't even go a hundred plus miles an hour in this, uh, on this dirt trail. Shit's not gonna work, man. Shit's not gonna work. Oh, damn, so good. Now, hold on, now the front end is clean? Did we, did we ride through like uh, some water or something? Or did we ride past some water? I don't even think that even worked like that. I 
don't think they got no car washes out here in the country either, man. We'd have to go back into the city to go to one of them car washes. You drunk us some speed. I'm about to get an oh shit. Take a little top speed run there real quick. You know what I'm saying? You can't go wrong with a little top speed run. Guys, make this happen, man. Hope you guys did enjoy the episode, man. If you guys did, make sure you drop a like down below. We're gonna get a free fix and clean in real quick just to finish the episode up. Let me know if you guys did enjoy, man. If you guys did, make sure you guys smash that like button down below. Hit the subscribe button. Make sure you guys uh, smash that like button. That's what I meant to say. Smash that like button. And I will definitely catch you guys in the next episode of last year, man. If you guys do want to get set up and be able to play GTA 5 like a boy, man, make sure you guys uh, join my Discord. Link is in the description. That shouldn't have happened. I don't know why it didn't blow. Oh, I don't think I did the get ratios for this. This one's fast as hell. Take a little second break. But yeah, man, hopefully you guys did enjoy, man. Catch you guys in the next one. Peace out now.